Put simply, aquaculture is farming at sea. Globally, hundreds of species are farmed, but the cool waters of Scotland lend themselves to salmon, trout, oysters, mussels, and seaweed. The most significant of these, at 96% of the total production, is Atlantic salmon, representing the UK's biggest food export. Compared to capture fishery, modern aquaculture is a new industry, taking commercial foothold in the 1970s. But already, half of the seafood we eat is farmed rather than wild caught, and this is only expected to grow. Compared to land-based farming, marine fish farming takes up very little space. In Scottish waters, only 0.002% of the surface is occupied by fish farms, against the 73% of Scottish land devoted to agriculture. Fin fish and shellfish farming are also very efficient methods of producing healthy protein. Salmon and trout benefit from excellent feed conversion ratios and a low carbon footprint, with emissions in line with those of sheep farming. Seaweed production, where kelp can grow up to 60 times faster than land-based plants, has been lauded as a carbon-negative business opportunity that could help reverse ocean acidification. The aquaculture industry in Scotland operates from a variety of different locations, from on-land hatcheries and tank-based systems to open net pens at sea, following the complex life cycle of the salmon. A relatively small number of producers is served by a supply chain covering equipment and technology, feed manufacture, processing and distribution. A recent report commissioned by the Scottish Government found that aquaculture contributed around £885 million to the wider Scottish economy and supported 11,700 jobs. Many of these jobs are in remote, rural communities providing well-paid employment for generations of people. With a rising global need for healthy protein and an increasing emphasis on responsible food production, the Scottish aquaculture sector is in a prime position to grow. This growth will involve innovation in the areas of technology, health and welfare, data and artificial intelligence, and exploring different locations, such as moving further out to sea or to land-based recirculation systems. SAIC's role is to help drive this innovation, to nurture the aquaculture professionals of the future and to share the knowledge gained through our work. Get in touch to find out how we can help.